disappointed everyone. So the France's head coach had some high praise for Victor, Victor Weminyama. Here's what he had to say. People who know basketball, they understood he's only 20 years old, but people who don't know basketball, they think Victor is already Michael Jordan. So I, I didn't fully understand what this quote was about. I think he, there, he's 100% right. Obviously, when he's young, he hasn't comp com accomplished anywhere near what Michael Jordan has accomplished at this point. But I do think, and we saw this in year one, that he is a fantastic player, right? That he is somebody who, if he could stay healthy, is going to be exactly what everybody thought he was going to be, right? Simply put, he was going to be everything that people hyped him up to be because he could defend, he could score, he has a jump shot. Is it the knockdown jumper that, you know, you may want to see? Not yet, but that's all coming, right? And the truth is, you know, because we've been a, we've been a channel that's really talked about, look, don't overhype these guys because it puts a lot of pressure on them. In Wemby's case, this is completely different, I think. Wemby needs talent around him in the NBA because he needs to start getting into those conversations, right? He needs to stop. He can't be on this team again next year with 22 wins, right? He's got to be on a team that really makes some, makes some noise in the playoffs in terms of even just making the playoffs and, you know, having a good series will be enough. And so the Spurs, if they can go out, if they can get talent, bring in talent, put it around him versus what they did, you know, what they had around him last year, I think that's the, the path forward for Wemby. But Francis' head coach clearly is not happy with the Michael Jordan comparisons. He's trying to temper expectations for Wemby which certainly is always smart. But I do think people should point out that so far what we've seen, Wemby's skill set can have him being one of the best players of all time if he's able to stay healthy and the organizations that he plays for if they're able to build a strong team around him. So thank you all for watching and we'll see you next time.